your family's <laughs> so weird. The first time I ever met AJ's family, they would always, like, without fail, no matter what the meal was, they would always have appetizers. And their appetizers were Triscuits. And I don't know if you know what Triscuits are. For those of you who grew up in the UK, remember shredded wheat? Imagine some shredded wheat, but it's savory, right? Triscuits was an appetizer. Um, a block of cream cheese with some special chutney. mystery chutney. Now, fair play, the chutney hate, was delicious. Oh my gosh, I hate chutney. <laughs> that was the worst part. I'd be like, can you make sure the chutney is only on half of that cream cheese? No, but what would be mysterious <laughs> is I loved the chutney before I discovered where the chutney came from. So there was, like, I think mom had this giant cauldron. <laughs> it was like, I, I have new wing of bat. Because she just had these like mason jars Mango that were chutney. not dated. Yeah. No. And it was just this like black syrupy tar like thing with chunks of yellow, <laughs> which presumably was mango. Mango, yeah. And it was just like this slurry. And I thought it was store bought. I know. And then one year I realized that the, <laughs> the cream cheese was I, a year out of date. I think she sent you into the basement to find the chutney and never did you have it again. No, but that wasn't even the grossest thing. <laughs> the grossest <laughs> thing was those Triscuits, block of cheese, <laughs> the weird mystery mango chutney, and... No, the oysters don't go on the chutney. No, but it's, they're right next to each other. Yeah, but the, you have, the oysters are only for plain cream cheese, not for chutney cream cheese. No, I understand. <laughs> okay. It doesn't make any better because okay. you would have oysters. You think, mmm, oysters, how sophisticated. Smoked oysters. No, no, no. <laughs> Just a, t- a tin. Just, <laughs> <laughs> it's Just like so good. somebody sneezed I... in a tin with chunks. <laughs> and then you're going to spread no. that on shredded wheat. You don't know what you're talking about. Oh, where, I do. Where are my smoked oyster people at? I... I love it. I I have two tins upstairs. Every once in a while, <laughs> I just open up a tin and eat them. <laughs> Bear with me. This was Uh-oh. ridiculous. But from my childhood, yeah. Take if, a, take a cocktail stick. Uh huh. Spear through, <laughs> spear through a slice of tinned pineapple. Uh huh. All right. Then a block of cheddar. And then a little grape on oh, top. Oh, that doesn't go together. <laughs> That's so gross. No, that but is, gets, you're mocking my cheese better. and you oysters. Would t- no, you would take a roast potato, you'd wrap it in foil, and it would be a hedgehog with all those, like, and you oh, just pick them up disgusting. and eat them. Oh, disgusting. All right, but you'd also get sausages Wait, what happened wrapped to the potato bacon? afterwards? You probably ate that too, No, right? no, no. It was just a holding thing. You. It was just a decorative uh-huh. thing. It was wrapped in foil for elegance. Oh, <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> we would have those like <laughs> you're you're picturing my dining room aren't you oh, <laughs> <my God. laughs> okay. Wrapped for elegance i'm ready oh. Oh. 